The work coordinates, also referred to as the work piece's origin, are one of the most important things that the programmer controls when creating a CNC program. With a typical three-axis CNC milling machine, the spindle will move up and down along a z-axis, while the workpiece is fixed to a table that moves in the x and the y directions. When the programmer assigns a work offset or a work origin to the program, it allows them to write the program without knowing where on the table the operator will fix the workpiece, and in fact without even knowing specifically which machine tool will be used. You can take a look at the CNC Quick Guide at cncquickguide.com for more information on machine tool offsets. What we're going to do now in Esprit is look at how to tell the software which work coordinate system to use for this program. Future videos you will learn how to tell Esprit how to use multiple coordinate systems and how to reposition these coordinate systems relative to the part being machined. In Esprit, using the project manager select the features tab and double click on the icon that looks like an XYZ axis at the top of the feature tree. This will open the work coordinate dialog. We're next going to label the work coordinate as G54 and set the coordinate number to 54. Doing this will allow the NC code to tell the machine tool which memory register holds the XYZ coordinates for this workpiece. You can also add a descriptive comment, something like G54, top center of the workpiece. For information about other options in this dialog, use the context sensitive help. If you click OK on the work coordinates dialog, you will see that the name of the coordinate system is updated in the features tree. You may also note that the location of the coordinate system is indicated in the graphics window when it's selected in the features tree, and you can also display this coordinate system by clicking on the UVW axis in the view menu.